Hey all, today we're going to go over EFI Live Explorer and connecting up your AutoCAL to your computer so you can transfer your files from your AutoCAL to your computer to email off to Will at Overkill Motorsports. This is going to be a very basic overview of how things work. I will go over uh, in another video using EFI Live Scan and Tune to adjust PIDs, uh, basically different sensors that your AutoCAL can scan. So, uh, if you do not have EFI Live on your computer, go ahead and open up a browser. And you're going to go to EFILive.com and click on Download once you're there. And you want to make sure that you download version 8. Version 7.5 will not work. Uh, so, download version 8 and install it. Once you have it installed, go ahead and connect up your AutoCAL with the included USB cable. Uh, and open up EFI Live Explorer. EFI Live Explorer is what allows you to read the files off of your AutoCAL and put them onto your computer. So this right here is going to be your AutoCAL down here and up here is going to be the file system on your computer. Um, I like to have a whole separate folder for all of my tuning files. Being organized is going to help you keep track of different things. Uh, I'm going to create a better experience for you and Will. The be better organized you are, uh, the better feedback and input you're going to be able to get from Will. Um, so in my EFI Live Files folder, I have my factory Camaro file, uh, my base overkill tuning files, and then my E85 overkill files. Uh, so what you're going to do uh, in your factory Camaro file, or whatever car it may be, is you're going to take your read, which is going to be the initial scan of your car that you send off to Will. You're going to click on it here and drag it to the factory Camaro file, or again, whatever you've named it and it'll transfer, usually takes about a minute. Um, then you could take a look, make sure it's here. Uh, I would also go ahead and make a copy of it and save it somewhere else. I have copies saved on my Dropbox as well as Google Drive just to make sure you have all of these files. Uh, your tune files are going to look about the same as the other, but they will generally be named something. Um, I always, uh, once I get those from Will, I save them right into my tuning file. Uh, right here. Uh, I'll put it like right in here. Those will come in an email format. Uh, then uh, any data logs you take will, from the AutoCAL will be on your scan folder here. Uh, drag them and drop them into data logs uh, or whatever folder you again set up. Uh, from there you'll go ahead and take those files, uh, whatever file that Will is requesting from you and send them over to him in an email. It's uh, willoverkill at gmail.com. There are a lot more things you can do with EFI Live. I will go over those here in a future video, uh, but this was just to get you started bare bones uh, with the EFI Live Explorer. If you have any questions, feel free to drop a comment or shoot me a message on Facebook or, or email, Derek1387 at gmail.com. Thanks.